first started in this business when I transitioned from an in-home childcare into a commercial brand, although you could see the New Orleans patterns within my business, I didn't never discuss um, what the symbols and what the colors meant until the last, within the last two years, I've learned that I am my brand. And so if I am my brand, I am New Orleans. My eldest is Deontre. She is 20 years old. She's in college right now. I had her when I was 16 years old. Um, I dropped out of school to raise her. At some point, I did go back. I did get my GED. I did graduate from um, Job Corps. And even after I finished with Job Corps and I graduated, I still grind. I still had this little bitty baby to take care of. And I am very proud of the woman that she is becoming today. Then I have Nathan. He's my 13 year old. He's my artist. Right now he's currently writing his first book. I am so proud of him. He likes to write raps, poems, and he's in the seventh grade at this time. So I'm very proud of the man that he's turning out to be also. He's very creative, very quiet. Then there's little Jamal. <laughs> Jamal is seven years old. He also is epilepsy. So Jamal, I, um, he's one of the reasons why I, most of the time you'll catch me working from home when he's going through an episode. So when I say I am very entwined with um, children and their health, he is the inspiration for that. Um, I will have to watch him very closely. Then there's my little bitty baby. <laughs> She's 10 months. Her name is Destin. Destin was the inspiration to, for me to keep going. Because honestly, doing that pregnancy, that pregnancy was hard. Having a child in your 30s, oh my God, it's like, it's really hard. And at the time of me being pregnant with her, I had a lot of things going on within the business and I felt like I wanted to give up. But at some point when I saw her face, she was an inspiration for me to keep going and she also was the inspiration to inspire me to start to write my book because she is the reason I kept pushing. She gave the she put the life back into what what it is that I was doing and why I was doing. So with that I love all of my children and I am grateful for every last one of them.